I could do a house in two-point perspective. And here's how I would start that out, just like every other two-point perspective project. Put my horizon line in. Pick my vanishing points. Uh, draw the box part of my building. Now, at this point, I'm going to stop because I want to put a nice um, tri triangular roof on top on this side. So I'm going to connect corner to corner to make an X in the middle. I'm going to do it really light because I want to erase it in the end next time. And then from that center point, I'm going to draw straight up. Somewhere on this line is where the top of my roof needs to be. I can decide if it's really tall and pointy, short and less pointy, uh, but I need to pick that spot and then connect it down to the corners of that box. Now I can get rid of all this extra stuff. So I've got this line hanging out in the middle of nowhere. It's on the right, so it's going to connect to the left. That gives me my little stoop. I've got this line that runs along this side of the building, so it's going to go that way also. And the top, because it's on the right, it's going to go to the left. Now I need to do a line parallel to this one, but at that end parallel to this roof line to finish my roof. And I've got a lot of extra things to get rid of. My horizon line. The top of my house that was in here. And then I can add shingles, um, which is just like how we did bricks or windows on the other building. Value is going to make all the difference to making this look like um, a real shingled roof. My next step would be to, you know, add the details on my building, put some details in my yard, and then add, you know, value, color, texture, stuff like that to make it look like a finished piece. 